Hi, my name is David Mia, also known as 3D DIY Dave on Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. I am a content creator, a maker, and a collector of tools. I have been known to do a lot of 3D printing and woodworking. Over the last couple of years, I have been exploring new technologies and sharing what I've been learning with the community. Uh, some of these are just new tool reviews, uh, wall-mounted CNC's, lasers, and of course, 3D scanning. So I have been working with Shining 3D for the last year, learning to 3D scan and exploring ideas that can be beneficial for makers. I was honored when Shining 3D reached out to me to see if I wanted to be one of the first to use the new Einstar scanner and put it through its paces. So let's take a look at the new scanner. The new Einstar is a compact handheld scanner that uses three cameras and three groups of VCSEL lasers, a color camera to capture color detail with a wide field of view for scanning quickly and smoothly. I found that the compact camera and lightweight body is much easier to use and scan for longer periods of time. It also is more ergonomic and easier to manipulate around objects. So let's take a look at what is included with the scanner. It comes in its own protective case here and a power cable for your country. Inside the case, it zips all the way around clamshell and you have the main compartment, which is the scanner itself. A cable for data and the cable for power. On the front flap on the main compartment, you have inside a calibration board that is protected by felt. One side is for the color calibration and the other is for the accuracy. And then included there is a shoulder strap for the case and the inside pocket here is a uh, tracking dots and a felt cleaner to clean the front of the scanner and of course the scanner itself. Over the last year, I have used 3D scanning to replicate things that were difficult to model and do 3D design. I have also used 3D scanning to document and digitize one-of-a-kind art, like the ones shown here from the late Jack Squire. There has been one area of 3D scanning that has really piqued my interest, and that is scanning people. So much so that I created an entire project called the Maker Scan Project. This project is an ongoing collection of scan makers from all over the world. The scan portraits are provided online for free for anyone to download and modify. People can collect their favorite makers, 3D print them uh, like action figures, or even create digital renderings with the files. Sharing these is a great way to provide other makers to explore and create interesting things with the digital file. The new Einstar scanner is perfect for this project. Cameras and built-in lasers allow me to scan people quickly, which is essential when people are just freestanding. Movement is always a concern, so scanning quickly allows people to be comfortable as well as be able to stand in dynamic poses. Another challenge with scanning people is hair detail and overall shape of hair. Einstar does an amazing job capturing hair at all detail levels. There are also additional settings to the hair for the new dedicated Einstar software. The scanner also uses infrared to scan people in all kinds of lighting conditions, including outdoors. After a few months of working with Einstar, it still impresses me with what it's capable of scanning from large scans like people down to very small objects. Recently, I got to take the scanner to a woodworking convention in Atlanta where my friend Stu from Yellow Mug Inc. got to see the scanner for the first time. Uh, Stu has helped me on some previous projects in the past with 3D scanning, so it was really cool to see what he thought of the new scanner. Let's have a look. So first impressions. Dave, yeah. this case is remarkable. <laughs> it reminds me of your backpack, actually. It is so my jam. Look. How is it so small? <laughs> is the color pack on this thing? Yes, there is. All, th all things serious. The yeah. form factor is incredible. Yeah. It was one of the big things with the previous generation is that the handle was so large and the form factor was large and inhibited going underneath or kind of getting three-dimensionally around objects. This is a game changer. And um, as I'm told, because it has the color pack inside, it allows that full resolution scan with color. Is, incredible. 
I love the, um, I honestly do love the case and how it's all compact and how it's, uh, you know, portable. I believe Einstar will be a very popular scanner in the market for its capabilities, its affordability, and versatility. I hope you guys get a chance to explore the world of 3D scanning with Shining 3D. If you'd like to ask me any questions uh, about Einstar, 3D printing, 3D scanning, DM me on all my social media platforms. Thanks for watching.